It is Vlogmas Day 15. Um, I've been up a little while now. It's about lunchtime right now, but I'm trying to finish up my laundry, which is all piled on my bed. Um, that's what I've been working on all morning, getting ready to put everything. Everything's been washed now. Um, it just needs to be put away. So I'm trying to get that done. Probably, I don't know what I'm going to do for lunch yet. We have nothing. Our fridge is empty, empty. Like, I don't think I've ever seen it as <laughs> empty as it is right now. Um, Jeff went to his brother's yesterday, which I told you guys that last night. My friend um, Tristan came over and we watched some Harry Potter and made butterbeer, which was freaking delicious, you guys. Um, and then I went to bed, got up, and got to work on my laundry. So, um, I gotta get together a grocery list. We gotta go to the store tonight. I think tonight, if Jeff gets back in time. Um, and then maybe, I told Jeff I wanted wings for dinner. He makes these really awesome grilled chicken wings. And I picked up some frozen french fries from Trader Joe's yesterday. Um, so yeah. That's the plan today, is just to get a bunch of housework done. Yeah. Yesterday was a complete fail. I couldn't, I hardly got any housework done yesterday because I was... I spent a lot of my time yesterday afternoon at the vet and yesterday morning. Um, and then I ran and did a couple of errands. I went to Trader Joe's. I went to um, Victoria's Secret. I did some Christmas shopping. And I stopped by Ulta and checked out the Naked 3 palette. I'm not sure if I want it or not. Um, but we'll see. They did have it at the Ulta that I went to. There were plenty in stock. So, hmm. Um, but I do need to go to Sephora because I have that $15 reward and I have something to return there. So, maybe I'll do that today. I don't know yet. We're doing our weekly grocery shop, which we actually really haven't done in a while. Um, and I was supposed to start a list, but instead I took a nap. So, I'm just sort of going on a whim here. They're probably sticking to some of our usuals. So Jeffy made dinner. Hamstring. We grilled some chicken wings. Buffalo. No, you said I grilled it, then you whatever. Sorry. Jeff grilled some buffalo wings. The buffalo. So we mixed buffalo sauce with barbecue sauce. And then made some french fries. We were going to do roasted cauliflower tonight too, but the market didn't have cauliflower. I didn't think of an alternative <laughs> vegetable, so. so we're good. We got our dinner. <laughs> is Vlogmas Day 16. Today is a beautiful sunny day out, and I sort of have a love-hate relationship with it right now. Um, it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Like, it's nice to be able to leave work and the sun is out. Um, I hate the winter months because the days are so short by the time I'm, I mean, I drive to work basically in the dark and then by the time I'm out of work and on my way home, it's almost completely dark out. So not a whole, I don't get to see the daylight a whole lot. Um, so yeah, love it because it's sunny and pretty and all that. It's still really freaking cold, but that's okay. Um, but hate it because I am wearing glasses full time until my doctor says it's okay for me to wear my contacts again after this little surgery on Thursday. Um, and because today would be the perfect day to take Lexi to the dog park. And I can't do that because she broke or stubbed her toe and is still on pain medicine and her vet wants her to take it easy until... Uh, wants her to take it easy until we know that she's healed up pretty well. So basically through the end of the week. Um, so today we're not going to be able to do that. Though I think I may take her to the park and take her for a walk at least. Um, I don't have physical therapy today after work. So um, yeah. So I have the time to actually do that. It's not going to be dark. Hopefully by the time I take her out there. So I'm going to throw on some sweatpants and some decent shoes and head out the door with her as soon as I get home. So that 
we can get some of her energy out, though it won't be a lot. <laughs> it was to go for a WALK at the park, but um, it's kind of hard to see. It's already about dark outside. <laughs> So that's not going to happen today. Lucky for Lexi, um, when we go to Wisconsin, my stepmom goes on daily walks with her dog, um, I think, or she tries to anyway. So we'll be able to <clears throat> join them on that. Though they're going to be very, very cold walks. Come here, Lexi, get inside. Good girl. So instead, I am going to work on getting the house cleaned up or tidied a little bit more. And I know that's been what I've been doing just about every day last week. Um, so it's not that I keep like a dirty house. It's that um, cleaning takes me personally a lot longer than it used to with my issues with my leg. Um, what used to take me probably two or three hours, I could clean the entire house in about two hours. Um, about a year ago or a year and a half ago and now it takes me like three days because I cannot be on my feet for longer than 45 minutes if I am Lexi no ma'am if I am um, I start getting my leg starts to my knee starts to swell really badly and it's just it's me being on my feet for an extended period of time so, like right now, all I have to do is unload the dishes and load up the dishwasher, because um, we didn't do that last night. I'm going to wash my car blanket that I have for Lexi, and I've got a bunch of mail I have to sort through on the kitchen table, and then upstairs, I just have to put away all of my laundry that I washed this weekend. So, it's not too much, but I mean, a lot of that takes standing. And normally I could do it pretty quickly, but I don't move so fast anymore because of my leg. And it's just a, a huge pain in the butt, to be completely honest. Um, so it's very frustrating. Jeff tries to help me out as much as he can and um, tries to get a bunch of stuff done. They don't necessarily get done right away, but <laughs> that's okay. He tries. Um, so yeah, tonight I think we're going to make pesto with roasted asparagus and sun-dried tomatoes um, and the brown rice quinoa mixed noodles which when I last went to Trader Joe's they didn't seem to have any in stock I didn't even see a little sign for them so I'm hoping this weren't temporary because those are our favorite kind of noodles that we sort of discovered um, brown rice is like second best but we really prefer the brown rice quinoa mix so I'm going to go ahead and start getting some things straightened up, um, start doing the dishes, and then get some cooking going, and then I think tonight I'm going to paint my nails, because my nails have not been painted, though they are cut down and filed down, and they look better than they did. So I think I'm going to paint them tonight. Um, Jeff's going to play video games with his friends again tonight, since he was gone this weekend. And... Yeah, time for me to clean. <laughs> so tonight for dinner, we are doing roasted asparagus with um, pasta and pesto and sun-dried tomatoes. Um, I can't stand asparagus. And that is one thing about being an adult. Um, you sort of know that you have to eat the foods you don't really like if they're healthy for you. So I think this is like the second time I've made it, and I, I can actually tolerate asparagus like this because it mixes in with the pesto and the mozzarella, and it's it's really good. So I'm going to roast this for, I don't even know how long. Usually I just sort of eyeball it, um, but probably about 10 minutes or so. And I'm going to go ahead and dice up the chicken and get the pasta going. Jeff should be home in about 20 minutes or so, so by the time he gets home, this will all be ready. Alright, finished product. I've got chicken, quinoa, brown rice mix, pasta, um, sun-dried tomatoes, and asparagus in there. It's pretty good. I picked up cupcakes from Gigi's Cupcakes. This one, the reindeer, reindeer? The reindeer is gluten-free. You sure you had no reindeer? No, I just had some Jim Beam. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
And then that one's just a chocolate one with some white frosting. It's a sprinkle. Mm -hmm. And sprinkles. Sprinkle. Jeffy has a reindeer. He gets to actually eat that cupcake. I don't know. Have you ever had a gluten free cupcake? <laughs> yum, yum. I don't know if I want that one. <laughs> Why? <laughs> gluten free is not always good. <laughs> Whatever. I think it'll be good. Tonight's going to be kind of a spa night for me. Sort of. Um, I'm about to take a lush bath here using some Epsom salt. Um, a limited edition bath or yeah, bath melt. Bath melt? Bubble water. <laughs> Something like that from Halloween that I never got around to using. And then I've got a Cinders and a Lush Putt in here from, I think they're from last year, honestly. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and use those. Um, and then definitely the Epsom salt. I, I don't know what I did to my neck, but my neck is not feeling very good today. So I'm going to relax in the tub, um, do some Christmas shopping online, which is why I've got this little table here. And then um, probably get out and paint my nails tonight, so... That is what I have in store. Kind of a relaxing night since I've done a lot in the last couple days. Orange water. I lost the bubbles because I used the entire bath bomb instead, or sorry, the entire bubble bar instead of breaking it up like I typically would. So yeah, I am looking forward to relaxing in here. I just dumped a bunch of Epsom salt in here, so it'll be nice and relaxing and very good for my muscles. Um, my knee's been quite swollen in the last couple of days, and, yeah, not fun. There is a sweet baby girl right here. <laughs> Laying down with me. So, the bath I just took was very relaxing. Um, I'm actually not going to paint my nails. I've already fallen asleep. I just woke up to turn out my lights. Um... So, I am going to go ahead and end today's vlog. Um, I might start editing, though not likely. I'm probably just going to go to sleep and edit this tomorrow night and put this one up. And hopefully, as of tomorrow, I will be on track. So, good night, guys, and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye! Lexi.